good morning students in this class i am going to discuss about estimation of metal losses in a forging process it is understood that always certain amount of material is lost during different forging operations therefore while calculating the volume of the material to be used for a component one has to add the material loss during forging operations the various losses to be considered are shear loss tongue hole loss scale loss flash loss and then screw loss so we are going to discuss about one by one okay first one shear loss blanks are cut from billets or long bars that means the blank required for forging a component is cut from billets or long bars by means of a sawing machine during sawing the material equal to the product of thickness of sawing blade and cross section of the bar is lost for each cut this material is material loss is known as shear loss similarly at the end of the billet pieces of smaller dimensions are mostly left these material loss are also included with shear loss in general the shear loss is taken as 5 percentage of net weight next tongue hole loss while performing some forging operation some length of the stock at one end is required for holding the stock in a tongue this small extra length will be removed after completion of the work piece this loss is known as tongue hole loss therefore this tongue hole loss should be added while calculating the required stock material so the tongue hole loss is <coughs> given by tongue hole loss which is equal to area of cross section of bar into length of tongue hole length of the tongue hole is generally taken as around 2 to 2.5 cm of the stock length next one is scale loss as the work piece is heated at high temperature during forging process the oxidization of the outer surface of the work piece will take place that is the heated work piece reacts with the oxygen from air forms a thin film of iron oxide on the outer surface of the work piece this thin film of iron oxide is called scale when hammering is done the scale is broken and falls down as a waste this material waste is known as scale loss generally the scale loss is taken as around 6 percentage of the net weight the next type of loss is flash loss when dies are used for forging certain quantity of material comes out of the die at the parting line of the top and bottom halves of the die this surplus wastage material is called flash loss flash loss is generally taken as 20 mm wide and 3 mm thick for finding the flash loss multiplying the volume and density of the material per volume of flash is circumference of the component at parting line multiplied by the cross sectional area of the flash so the cross sectional area of flash is nothing but flash thickness multiplied by the flash width so this is the formula which is used to calculate the flash loss the next one is sprue loss the portion of the metal between the length held in the tongue that is tongue hole and the material in the die is called sprue or runner this is cut off when work piece is completed the material loss due to this portion of the material used as a contact is called sprue loss the sprue has generally taken as 7% of the net weight 
Thank you.